The magic brush. Once upon a time, there was a poor child named Ma Liang. He liked painting very much, but he can't afford a paintbrush. One day, Ma Liang saw an artist painting a picture for a high-ranking official. Ma Liang was interested and walked in uncautiously. Could you lend me a paintbrush, please? I want to learn painting too. A poor boy like you wants to learn painting. <laughs> Why? A poor boy can learn to paint too. From then on, Ma Liang practiced painting every day. He could lie on the ground and paint the birds and the fish. He painted whatever he saw. Ma Liang. Will you also paint for the high-ranking officials after you master the skill? I won't do that. I will only paint for the common people. As days went by, Ma Liao made great progress. Then one evening, an old man with a white beard appeared in front of him. Ma Liao, I will give you this brush now. Go paint for the common people. Ma Liang was so excited. He immediately painted a roaster on the wall. The roaster came alive. It turned out that he got a magic brush. With this magic brush, Ma Liang painted for the people in his village every day. Whatever he painted came alive. When the high-ranking official heard that Ma Liang had a magic brush, he asked Ma Liang to paint gold ingots for him. Hmm, I won't paint that. How dare you! Put him in jail! When the guards were asleep at night, Ma Liang painted a door on the wall. He opened the door and got out. High-ranking officers sent soldiers to chase Ma Liang down. However, Ma Liang had already run far away by riding a horse he painted. One day, the official took away Ma Liang's magic brush and asked the painter to paint in a money tree with it. The official rushed to shake the money out of the tree. Bam! He hit the wall. The painted money tree didn't come alive. Ouch! Ouch! It hurts. The official had to set Ma Liang free. Good boy. Please just paint a picture for me. Ma Liang managed to take the magic brush back, so he agreed. Fine, just this once. <laughs> the official was very happy and gave the magic brush back to Ma Liang. Ma Liang paint an endless sea on the wall. I didn't ask you to paint a sea. Draw a mountain of gold quickly. Ma Liang made a few small dots. Then a mountain of gold appeared, made completely of gold. Wow! Paint a big boat quickly. I'm going to the mountain to get gold. Ma Liang painted a big boat. The official jumped into the boat with the painter and some soldiers. Get boat moving quickly. Ma Liang painted a gust of wind, and then the boat moved straight towards the center of the sea. The official complained it was too slow. Make the wind stronger. Ma Liang ended some strong gusts of wind. Blood waves appeared, and the boat began to tilt to one side. The official was frightened. Oh, enough! Enough! Ma Liang ignored him and kept painting wind. The wind blew more fiercely. The sea was roaring, and the waves were falling down towards the boat. The boat overturned, and the official sank to the bottom of the sea. After that, Ma Liang returned to the village and only painted for the ordinary people.